and Jeffrey. You look so cute. You look like Tim Ryan. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Rachel, and I'm going to sing Non Pumessa uh, from Cenerentola, her last aria. <clears throat> Was really okay tell me where you are with this aria um eight about eight months into it yeah but where are you from uh, ireland Dublin. i thought i heard a bit of the irish <laughs> oh, you know i was born joyce flaherty i know okay i have a question for you right off the bat when you go up to that glorious top uh, where does your voice, what, ha what happens? Like I'm talking about the final B's and the A's and all, what's happening? What's, um, what are you feeling? Um, I suppose I'm always trying to just release all my tensions and it doesn't always happen, but when it works, like, you know, it just sort of feels like nothing is going on and it just, you know, happens up at the back. It feels like I'm doing nothing. It feels so easy. It doesn't feel like anything's happening. Yeah. That's when you know you're in absolutely the right groove. Yeah. The second you start feeling something, and I'm not talking about breathing or vibration or phonation, I'm talking about muscular engagement of any sort, especially in yeah. this region. Mm. Big, amazing gift, because it tells you that you're not on the right track. Yeah. That's such a great thing to happen. You're like, oh, wow, that's the wrong path. <laughs> <laughs> wow, it was going so well. <laughs> I best go back. Amazing. To my ear, what happens up there is slightly different than what's happening down. Oh yeah, okay. Or do you feel that? Yeah, yeah, definitely. I, my sensation, I could totally be wrong. My sensation is that you're trying to make sound down there. Yeah, probably, yeah. Feel that? Definitely. Trying to make beef it, it happen. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay, what happens when we try and beef up the sound is it goes, <gasps> becomes a football player. <laughs> And then somehow, when we kind of just let it go right back on the breath, it kind of goes, ah, oh, there, it's over the orchestra. It's on this thread. And I'm not talking about a narrow sound or anything. I'm just talking about economy. Yeah. Economy is the name of the game in opera. So one thing I would recommend that you do, I would smear everything. Non più me sta 
jar. Okay, it's all kind of in, I would just let it be smeary for a while rather yeah. than trying to, you know, because yeah, it yeah. always seems like it's in a different place. Yeah. That's just kind of an overall thing. Cool. Use the thing that doesn't feel like any work and sounds like a million bucks as your guide to what your sound is. Okay. Because that's spectacular, right? I mean, it's stunning. So we want that in your whole voice. Okay. What's your first first four notes that you sing? Can you give us a G sharp? G sharp, yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Cool. The great thing about Rossini is he took so much time to write all the notes. Yep, we want to hear every yeah, single okay. one. Yeah. Okay? <laughs> Look, there's nothing happening underneath you. No orchestra. You've got you need to be in time, but you have all the expressive Thing. What does Nakwela Fanno mean? What are we saying? Um, I was born to woe and suffering. What I want to sense is this, the importance of what you're saying, okay? Mm -hmm. I think sometimes we don't give Rossini enough credit for what he's written. If the world could live Nakwela Fanno and the idea of forgiveness, it's utopia. This is why we come to music. Make us better people. Help us feel something. Help us understand something. It's not just for vocal display. It's because it's what the world needs. It's the, that moment it needs to be heard. Yeah. Yeah? Can you give us a little... No pressure. I'm all emotional. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, see, I just got, I just got that. Okay. Why? Why do we go wow? Honest, truthful. Honest, truthful, simple. And it had nothing to do with sound. Sound is a result. Yeah. You were connecting. I still have goosebumps. <laughs> That's so cool. And you breathed? Mm. Big deal. Yeah. Awesome, because then you could do more with the pianto. There's no breath police. <laughs> no, nobody's gonna arrest you for taking a breath. But that is like, I've gotta make it through one phrase because I do that. I'm... <laughs> Dang the cameras. Oh well, <laughs> shoot, who cares? I hear Chichili Bartoli, I'm like, oh, I've gotta do that one breath. She does it in one breath. I'm like, no, I don't. I mean, if I can, great, but it's not, we get into this comparison thing and it's like you have to express it the way you feel, Yeah. you know? What did you do, what happened for you in that phrase? I wasn't thinking about sound at all, which I know is what you're supposed to do, but... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Who says that? Give me their name and number. Uh, <laughs> um, well, you're not supposed to listen to yourself. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. And I, we do have to think about sound because yeah. it's our instrument and we yeah. want the sound to be beautiful, of course. But if your purpose is to make that sound, make the sound serve your expression. Yeah. This, again, the second we get into making sound or creating sound, chances are we're manufacturing something to be different than what we organically are. Yeah. Hello in life. <laughs> <laughs> we get in trouble when we do that. <laughs> so coming back, you yeah. weren't thinking about sound. No. Just thinking about what I was saying, and I wasn't worrying about that breath. I was like, okay, whatever, yeah. you know, I'll just take it. And your breath was right there for you. Yeah. Can we try it one more time? Cool. And just, yeah, let's just do that one more time. <clears throat> now also, sorry, a technical thing. Mm -hmm. You said earlier, you're like, I'm so emotional, ha. Huh? Mm -hmm. Okay, technically, that's a great artistic thing to feel. Mm -hmm. Amazing. Terrible thing as a singer, because we have to be solid, right? So what do you do technically? Like I was joking, just breathe and phonate. Sometimes it comes down to that, but you can also go, nah. that settles everything. Nah. And then you're there. Okay. That, mm, that simple, without having to go, ah, ah is such a scary open, you know, there's the Grand Canyon and I'm on a thin wire going, ah. <laughs> so safe. <clears throat> All those, use those consonants that will just, boom, bring you right back home. Take all the time on that.
Okay, do me a favor. Mm -hmm. Sing E there. E. So okay. free. So free. Mm -hmm. So free. Your tongue is really high in the back. Say, go E. E. Go E. 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 Okay, I hear E. I hear E, e right there. Uh -huh. And I want to hear E. E. Oh, wow. <laughs> Hello, the light just went on. Go E. E. Wow, yes. That's an Italian eval. Okay. So free, free, so free, so free. So, is that, you hear that there? So free. Better. So gentle. Mm -hmm. so, this is finger painting. Oh, yeah. Then you fall. Mm -hmm. So, ba -da -da. <sighs> okay. This is one thing I want to talk about in the in the. I'm skipping around a little bit here, but yeah. when I started talking about the homogeny of the voice, yep. pure vowels are going to be your friend. Maybe not way up there, but you're yep. handling that fine. But in all this, the more you can be on a really pure vowel, which more often than not means that the tongue you're not putting the tongue up, but it's going. E. e. Oh, wow, the tongue goes up when I say E. Yeah. Fabulous. The higher, the, oddly enough, the E vowel, it's the freest of vowels. Huh. Because everybody say ah, ah. Oh, oh, e. e. Where does your tongue go on the E? It goes whoop right up there. You feel the top teeth. If your tongue is up there, it's not in your throat. Ah, oh, e. So it means that's when your throat is the most open. Yeah. So if you're going, <laughs> you're, the, there's nothing, everything's kind of constrained in here. Yeah. So just put that in your mind to go home and start thinking about clear vowels, especially in the middle voice and low voice. Yeah. Clear vowel. And <clears throat> that's just going to make your voice go voom, which is going to make your top go even more whoo, stratospheric. <laughs> It's gonna be cool, <laughs> okay? Um, yeah, let's just try that much one more time. Now, simplicity, simplicity, say the words every, so you say, and you can move that. You take the time on the beginning. Go into the and I cried. You could have said suffered, you could have said anything else, but you choose pianto. And in that pianto is all those tears you remember. <sighs> I was by myself and nobody would listen to me. My dad's gone. And my mom, she got so angry if she heard me crying. You know, so I had to cry quietly. Nobody could hear me. E al pianto. Okay. Awesome. <clears throat> descending ones go up mm. yeah <gasps> magic and that's gonna lead you to make sense definitely Good. pure vowels especially yeah the e, e. the a ah, the o <laughs> <laughs> yeah but of all of those down there yeah it sounds a little uh, okay. this to me I mean yeah. it's again okay, it's really yeah. it's lovely but I think you're gonna get more clarity okay if you're just working about Pure vowel. Yeah. That first thing, because it is muscle memory, as you said, yeah. this becomes the drill. Okay? So you're going to be walking along the street. I do this all the time, and I think people must think I'm crazy. It's like, no, 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 no. Because if I go, no, we are, no, 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 we are. Oh, there it is. No, we are. 
don't, and then pretty soon the muscle memory's gone. So you just have to, you know, three minutes a day. Keep doing it. Yeah. yeah. Oh, and trill. Oh, okay. We've got 30 seconds to figure out how to do a trill. <laughs> awesome. Now, when you, here's the thing. If you're going to do a trill, yeah. it needs to be a trill. Yeah, absolutely. You can't fake it. How does one do a trill? It's so easy. <laughs> no, pe people have different um, definitions of it. I got into a discussion with Miss Marilyn Horn, and, and I said, oh, yeah, I think, you know, I think you have to really work at the trill. She's like, they come naturally. I went, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I had to work on mine, okay. <laughs> I still do. And your trill was awesome. I love that it came naturally. It's an exercise, okay? okay? And it's boring, totally unartistic work, which is so boring to us, right? But if you can master it, it can become really artistic. Yeah. So middle C, high C, middle G, high E, where this starts yeah. in your car. Um, you're going to do it piano, you're going to do mezzo piano, mezzo forte. Mixing it up, you're going to do different vowels, and you're going to do whole step and half step. Yeah. So all different combinations, and never the two in the same way. So again, we don't work that groove into the voice. And it's just really boring. You can even use it with a metronome. You're going to go whole note to half note to quarter note to triplet to eighth note to sixteenth. So it'll be like... Ah, and concentrating on the upper note, because when we get a trill, people will pulse the bottom note. And what makes the trill is the upper note. You breathe where you need. And then you try and like let it go. <laughs> it's the controlled loss of control. Okay. But, yeah. So, but you've got to let the <clears throat> chords get used to what free, free, going back and forth. That the pitch is changing here, nothing's happening here. <laughs> then I'm going to stop myself. It's like, can I still hear that, sec that top note? And you just play around like that. Literally five minutes a day. Yeah. In a month, you'll have a trill. Cool. Maybe six weeks, I don't know, maybe a week. <laughs> but it has to be, don't make sound doing it, just let yeah. it be really kind of easy. Yeah. But do that because the repertoire you're gonna do, you need a trill. Yeah. It's yeah. inexcusable not to have one. <laughs> and you can get it, that's yeah. the thing. I mean, you, you may have a better or a worse one, but you can at least have a one. trill. Beautiful work. Thank yeah, it makes you so sense. Much. Yeah, absolutely. Thank you so much.